Hello there, Nancy Crawford here with another little tip for you or technique. We're going to be looking today at embedding tissue paper into wax. So what I'm working with here is you, you could see I was I just put a couple of layers of wax on a small mat board square. And here I've got a tissue transfer that I did using acetone. I'll probably end up showing how I did that in another um, little video. But you could use here drawings that you've done on tissue paper. It might be napkins uh, that you've peeled apart. It could be some decorative tissue papers. And once I basically got it to where I wanted on my wax surface and I used just the warmth of my hand to do some rubbing, I then covered it here with a layer of encaustic medium. And now I'm basically taking the heat gun to it to embed it into the layer of wax beneath and the layer of wax that's gone on top. So it's kind of like a tissue sandwich. And what I usually do is put on at least three or four layers of wax over the top of a, a tissue paper surface just to really embed it in there. Also, I usually end up doing some incising over the top of pieces like this. So I want to make sure I've got a surface there that I can carve into. So you can see here I incised a couple of the circles from those postage marks and did some some text work as well. Now this is very similar. It's another piece of um, tissue paper. This one here I did some rust prints on and which is a really fun thing to do. And uh, I'm basically doing the same thing. I've you know situated the rust print on my little mat board square that had a couple of layers of wax on it. I did wax over the surface and here I'm taking the heat gun to fuse that in. One of the areas you have to be really um, particular with are the corners to make sure that they really get embedded into the wax. To trim off the excess what I would do is after I've done several layers of wax I let it cool, I fl flip the piece upside down and using a really sharp X-Acto knife I would just cut any excess off the edges. So here I am just taking another little scrap of rust printed tissue paper and filling out some, some other areas of rust and, and texture in the negative space on that piece. Taking the wax to it of course and you can see how that tissue moves around. Uh, but once you get the wax on there it really stays solid. I'll take the heat gun to this of course and fuse it in. And then of course as always I build up a couple of layers of wax you know, letting it cool in between each one. And then I might do some other surface treatments just to finish that off before I think of the pieces complete. So I hope you'll try this, some tissue paper, um, you know, embedding tissue paper in different works and uh, have fun with it. Have a great day.